Hi guys, welcome back to another hair product review on this channel and thanks for tuning in again. In today's video, we are going to talk about Nostalgic Grooming's Moon Paste, which is a medium to medium high hold paste that gives you a natural shine while keeping your hair kind of flexible and also making it kind of soft and easy to manage. So this is a product that I rediscovered recently. I initially bought this thinking it would be a matte paste. Now when I initially found this product my hair length was a good bit shorter than it is today and the shine level back then was just a tad bit too much for me. About a couple of weeks ago I rediscovered this because I out of whatever reason decided to use it as a pre-styler and then found that it worked actually pretty well for my now pretty long hair. First off, as usual, let's talk a little bit about the packaging. I was of the impression that this would be a glass jar when I ordered it because it looked very similar to the glass jars that are used by, for example, the Diamond Barber range of products. So I think in terms of its design, it's actually a super nice packaging. However, I would have wished for a slightly more premium jar because this does feel kind of cheap. Next up is the scent, which is called Cosmic Coconut. So there is two versions of Moon Paste, one firm hold version and one medium hold version. And the original medium hold version has a scent called Cosmic Cologne, which is a very slight, slightly sweet cologne type scent. It's not super strong and I have to say that the firm hold version has a stronger scent on one hand and on the other hand it's also very very coconutty. So this is more or less a very natural smelling coconut scent at least in my opinion. And although the scent is stronger in the firm hold version it's not overpowering at all and it doesn't interfere with your perfume choice or anything like that. In terms of its consistency Moon Paste Firm Hold is quite similar to the Arcadian Matte Paste. So it's a firm product, it's a dry product, it's a thick product but a significant difference between the two products is that Moon Paste dissolves as soon as it hits your hand. So you distribute it between your palms and it's almost not noticeable that there is a product between your hands and it's equally easy to distribute it evenly on your head. In my opinion, it's quite difficult to put into words what Moon Paste does in terms of hold because it is on one hand a very light product and it's almost not noticeable when you have it in your hair, but on the other hand, it does have a firm hold depending on the way that you use it. As I told you before, I started using this again a couple of weeks ago, first as a pre-styler, and I can tell you that it works excellent if you use it first before blow drying and then blow dry your hair into position and then top it off with a little bit more of this moon paste. However, moon paste is also insanely light and insanely non-sticky. So this is probably why it didn't work as well with shorter hair because the stickiness needed to give my hair a high hold when I had shorter hair simply isn't there. So as you can see, it's super light, I can go through it, but then when I get it into position again, the hold is still there. So that's what I also think makes this super interesting. Now I have to see if my, if my hair is still looking good. Anyways, I think this makes it pretty unique in terms of what it does because it feels so natural but also gives you a relatively high hold when you use it correctly. The shine factor as you can see is in fact more on the natural side of things. So it's kind of comparable to a heavy clay or a clay type product giving you loads of texture and also that slightly wettish type look. It's not a super matte, super dry looking product. And again, I can tell you that I'm really satisfied with the level of shine that I have going right now. But when I compare it to when I had shorter hair, it was a little bit too much, as was the case with a whole bunch of products for example, also like Ocean Clay by Shivu. So that's a possible issue that you have to be aware of. This works better with longer hair and not so good with shorter hair, at least in my opinion. So what are my concluding thoughts on Moon Paste? I think it's an interesting product. I initially misjudged it for what it was able to do, but I think overall it's quite unique in what it does 
and it definitely has its place in my collection of hairstyling products. If you are interested in buying this product, I'm going to link everything in the description box down below. So please check the links in the description to see if you uh, would like to order it. But that's about it for this video. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel and you want to see more videos like this, then please subscribe. It's for free and the button is just below this video. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time and bye-bye.